Tischsäcket war's im Mars Schack ich nie mehr fürs Hinschad Dürf sich selber auf Moje um Gebrock um mich zu sehen um So he can do is he can, for example, Batman we have here with his Bruce Wayne double head, he can rotate and pick an alternative one. So that's his shocked face. Is he can grab a hold of a minifigure like Batman? Besides this, he also has this really cool sound when he's moving his arms. It's like a crocodile snapping his jaw. So let me show you the way he could grab Batman. But before we go into that, there's Batman and his jet ski. which is rotatable um, and inclinable a bit. And on the back right here, you have his batarang. Oh. Let me detach him and show you what the scene looks like. Double 
possible. He had a face. His batarang is kind of difficult to be caught. But eventually, She's better rank. As you can see, there's no alternative face for him, it's just, that's the only face he has. There's the Mohawk, detachable. His hairpiece. And you have Tarantula. With two alternative faces. A more of a sm smug one. More of a angry one, as well. 
was her head hairpiece. And two truncheons. Nice arm print. Finally, we have the truck itself. Let me remove the minifigures out of the way for a second. The truck itself has a back suspension. Very nice rims. And a lot of customize, customization on the front. Um, you have this big search light and armor on the front, which is detachable. As well as a movable bow skull on the engine. The engine is unique with an air intake and cylinders and everything. A lot of stickers from Killer Crocs damaging nails on the top hood and sides. On the sides you have this, I think, pipe leaking some sort of a gas or I don't know what it is. Correct me if I'm wrong. You can see right here on the cover. My theory is that Batman is trying to stop the trio from poisoning Gotham's water basins and they're throwing these chests right here um, which are launchable via these two rotatable cranks here so when I drop or take one they fall. Same on the other side. One of them is full of frogs. And has this nice warning crocodile sign. The other chest on the other side. Again, you just crank that and it falls down. Is a chest with a set of dynamite. A drawback of the model is that both of the chests are very easily detachable from the back. Everything you see here is easily detachable, including the so-called mirrors. A drawback of the model is that the doors cannot be opened, but the top hood is openable, so you could stick, for example, tarantula inside. No problem. We'll place her inside rather. Now, the back, the top and front I showed you, there's a lot of custom lights and search lights. But the back section, not the driving compartment, the back compartment, 
is deliberately made in such a way, as you can see, the driving wheel was extended. Because we could make Killer Croc drive it. And that's what we'll do now. Batman is safe, at least for now. Okay, as you can see, we have this big gear shaft with a number with an eight ball and it is lowerable, liftable and movable on two sides. And we can just grab our big killer croc, big thick. Aside from all the falling small pieces and chests, the set is amazing in my opinion. And although you can barely see any of Kilcroc on the movies, you can in the games. I think. potential for a lot of fun with this truck because it's very customizable all right let's for us the final touch make Batman or Bruce Wayne with his alternative proper face. There we go. And get him on the jet ski. The cape is a bit difficult to be fixed. But it's achievable. There you go. I hope you enjoyed the whole building process and the um, entirety of the set, just as much as I did. And again, Thank you for the support and for watching. I hope to see you next time for more experiments or Lego or other kinds of ASMR. Enjoy your good night.
I sleep. If you've already fell asleep, you have a good rest. And if the day is ahead of you, have a peaceful, satisfying, satisfactory rather, and successful day. This has been the old wardrobe experiment. See you next time. Peace.